you guys is Donald here. As you can see, this video is my introduction to the vinyl community. Um, I want to join you guys now because I collect vinyl records, obviously, and I made videos, so why not just make an official video? Um, this video, I'm hoping to get more subscribers and more uh, views. So, yeah. Um, my first vinyl record I got was in August 2010. It was a blue album by the Beatles. It was my mom that she got from a friend, but she let me have it because I was getting into that stuff. The condition when I got it, though, wasn't so good. But I don't have it anymore because the condition got so bad and it wasn't worth anything. So I didn't really want to have a horrible record. But um, a week after or so, in 2010, when I got that, my dad gave me his Beatles 65. So, uh, and it played perfectly. So I still have that and it still does play perfectly. So I'm glad to still have that at least. <clears throat> yeah. I collect a lot of records now. If you want to see them, just check out my uh, final record collection, parts 1, 2, and 3. Um, records I mainly try to look for is just the ones that mainly reasons why I go to the record store. Collect The Beatles, The Doors, Jimi Hendrix, um, The Grateful Dead, The Animals, Pink Floyd. Um, like Zeppelin and the Who. If I'm in the mood, I sometimes try to find Beach Boys and Rolling Stones. Um, my two favorite bands are The Beatles and The Doors. Um, The Doors only have two albums, though, because it's kind of hard to find their, like, discography, their main albums, or Jim Morrison. Um, I have a lot of Beatles because, uh, I really love the Beatles. Um, I got into the Beatles. Well, I really listened to them my whole life, but the first Beatles song, I think I was four, my dad told me. Um, I listened to I Want to Be Your Man off Meet the Beatles cassette tape he had, and I was always singing it. And I remembered other songs I listened to off of it, like I Want to Hold Your Hand, I Saw Her Standing There. My dad also had Beatles 65 cassette tape. Um, but I really got into them, like, um, in, uh, like September 2009, um, when I was really heavy into video games, when I went to Blockbuster to rent uh, Guitar Hero 5, I saw Beatles rock band, so I decided to run it because I knew the Beatles a little bit and it was a new rock band, so it's like, I'll get this. So when I got in and played the songs, I really liked the songs. So then, like a few months after, I got the Beatles one CD, and then I got the Beatles rock band for Christmas, and that's what really got me into Beatles. And then, yeah, like I said, I got the first record. Um... So when I try to look for Beatles, I have uh, lots of, uh, I at least try to find the originals first. I'm only missing Beatles story. It's kind of hard to find. I only seen it once for 20 bucks, but I didn't want to get it, and it wasn't original anyway. Um, try to get originals, and then if I want, I get other variations. I'll show you the differences for people who aren't familiar with the Beatles, really. Um, show an original and then a, uh, later. Here's Beatles 6. This is an original. Um, here's a difference on the back. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but it says C label for correct playing order. So the songs are all out of order. Um, so you just have to see the label. I don't know why. I don't really know how they categorized it there. It's just mostly random. Um, here's, I'll show you the label. Sadly, I don't have an original sleeve. It's just a random one someone, I guess, put in. Here's the label. <clears throat> Sorry, I don't know if you can see that, but it's the Rainbow Capital. 
Yeah. And then I'll show you the later pressing of the same album, Beatles 6. Here's this one. It actually now on here says side one and then it has the correct order. And then uh, side two. Um, it almost, nope, some of the songs are out of order. Oh uh, yeah, so then it has the correct order for you. <clears throat> I don't know if this is the right sleeve though. My sleeve says printed in Canada, but my record says USA on it. I'm from the US, and it's a purple capital. It was probably from 78 or 80. And the original came out, I believe, in 65. Not sure which month. Uh, probably a little early, because it was, I think, before help. Um, yeah. So I really want to be a part of this. I'm hoping to get uh, more subscribers and more views. Um, so yeah, if you want to see my videos, I made obviously videos before this. So ch please check out my videos before this one. And then my videos that are released after this video. Because I didn't make this video before my videos so yeah so thanks for watching please uh make sure to subscribe and watch my videos so thanks bye